Good evening. I'm not sure I'm in with your evening news bulletin. NPA sets a date for deciding on Malema's assault. Convicted killer Jason Road denied bail. Unpaid housing contractors will get their money in 15 days. National Prosecuting Authority said an investigation into the alleged discharging of a firearm in public by the Economic Freedom Fighters leader Julius Malema had been completed. Last year, Malema was seen in a video firing what looks like a powered automatic rifle into the air at his party's fifth celebration in the Eastern Cape. The Halting NPA has said they would decide on Tuesday whether or not Malema would face renewable 2012 corruption charges and be prosecuted by the NPA. Convicted killer Jason Road will not be a free man pending the outcome of his appeal in the Supreme Court of Appeal. Road was found guilty in November last year for killing his wife Susan. In February, he was sentenced to 18 years for murder and five years for staging the suicide. The court was not persuaded but that the facts before it were sufficiently compelling to justify his release and denied him bail. Gauteng MEC for Human Settlements, Lebohang Maile, had a groundbreaking meeting with human settlements contractors mandated by the government to build house in the province. According to department spokesperson Castro Ngobeze, Maile's engagement with contractors was necessitated by the fact that this had a negative impact on the PM to meet their delivery targets. MEC made a firm promise that the contractors will be paid within 15 days. Let's take a look at your traffic and weather updates. Thank you, Nongtulu, taking a look at our traffic this evening. In Midran, on the N1 northbound, there's an accident seen at the Allendale Road causing queuing traffic. In Eden Vale, on the N3 northbound, roadworks are causing queuing traffic. The right lane has been closed after the Gililis interchange. In Pretoria, on Lavender Road, on the eastbound, congestions are causing delays towards the Steve Beaker Road. Taking a look at our weather, Johannesburg is at 17 degrees Celsius, Pretoria is at 18 degrees Celsius, Alberton is at 17 degrees Celsius. Back to the news desk. That's it from me and the Jobic TV team. Goodbye.